Thanks for purchasing an Ultralight Mark V from Motu. Let's take a look at what comes inside the box. In the box, you'll find the Ultralight Mark V interface, the power adapter, the manual, and some USB cables underneath to connect the interface to the computer. Note that there are two USB cables. Set aside the USB cable that is appropriate for your computer's USB connection type. If your Mac has USB-C ports, use the USB-C to USB-C cable. If it has USB-A ports, use the USB-C to USB-A cable. On the inside of the box lid, you'll find quick setup instructions. The serial number for your Ultralight Mark V can be found on the bottom of your unit and on the side of the box. You'll need the serial number to register the unit and download optional software, instruments, and loops. For details about how to get these free included assets, watch the next video in this series. Your Ultralight Mark V is plug and play on Mac. However, we recommend installing the Mac driver for reduced latency and other driver features like QMix 5 and low latency hardware monitoring. To do this, click the link below to download the Ultralight Mark V driver. After it downloads, navigate to your downloads folder and find the Ultralight Mark V installer package. Double click it to launch the installer. Click Allow. Continue. Continue. Agree. Continue. And install. You'll need to enter your Mac user account password to start the installation. While installing, keep an eye out for this message. This is a standard macOS message that is asking you to allow the Motu driver to run. Depending on your operating system version, the layout and wording of this message will look slightly different. Regardless, you need to click the button that says Open Security Preferences. This will take you to the macOS Security and Privacy System Preferences. In here, you should see a message that says either System Software from Developer Motu was blocked from loading, or System Software from Application Motu Gen 5 System Extension was blocked from loading. Unlock the lock icon in the bottom left corner of the window, enter in your Mac password, and then click Allow. After doing so, you can go back into the driver installer and wait for it to complete. Once it finishes, it should say that the installation was successful, at which point you can restart your computer. After your computer restarts, plug in your Ultralight Mark V with the appropriate USB cable and connect the power cord. It should automatically power on. After it powers up, go to the System Preferences, Sound, and confirm your Ultralight Mark V is selected for both input and output. Connect a pair of speakers or headphones to the unit. The volume knob can be found here. Turn the knob to adjust the volume level. Press the knob to switch between main out volume and headphone volume. Now, try opening iTunes, YouTube, Spotify, or another music source. When you hit play, you should hear the music from your speakers or headphones connected to your Ultralight Mark V. You're now ready to go. Please watch the next video in this series to get the most out of your Motu Ultralight Mark V.